Kaduna, the fourth most populous state in Nigeria, with an estimated population of between 8.8 .8 and 12 million, is a commercial and industrial hub in northern Nigeria, blessed with agricultural resources, mineral reserves, and human capacity. Since its creation, the state has had 18 governors, nine of which are military and nine civilian, all of whom made significant impact in shaping what Kaduna is today. A technocrat per excellence, a visionary who holds a first-class honor in quantity surveying from the prestigious Amadou Bello University Zaria, a law degree from the University of London, a master's degree in public administration from Harvard, and was conferred upon a national honor, the Officer of the Order of the Federal Republic of the Niger, OFR. His Excellency Malam Nasir Erufai was sworn in on the 29th of May 2015 as the 18th Governor of Kaduna State. Malam Nasir Erufai's years of experience working in the public and private sector indeed qualifies him as the man for the job, having held management positions at Motorola Inc and AT&T Network Systems International, established and successfully ran a project management consulting firm, was the Director General, Bureau of Public Enterprise, and was Minister of the Federal Capital Territory. With an unwavering focus on development, investment, and security, Governor Nasiru Erufai introduced several innovative reforms aimed at cutting costs of governance and achieving efficiency in public service. He implemented the Kaduna State Development Plan, a five-year plan to accelerate private sector investments, rapid infrastructural development, policy reforms and progress monitoring, all in a bid to reposition the state for economic growth. As well as the Kaduna Infrastructure Master Plan, a 32-year plan aimed at addressing infrastructural needs to position the state for industries and businesses, delivering jobs, social justice, sustained social economic growth, and development. Physical infrastructure is key to development and for many people seeing a road pass by their house or seeing water in their homes or electricity is the best form of the dividend of democracy. So we've invested in that as well. We, we, we believe that uh, human capital is the foundation of progress. The El Rafai-led administration also implemented the International Public Sector Accounting Standards for Public Finance Management and Reporting, enacted the Public Procurement Law in 2016, improved the welfare of civil servants by sustaining and ensuring prompt payment of salaries, ensured citizen participation in governance with the Open Governance Partnership Platform, pioneered the implementation of Treasury Single Accounts, TSA, in the state, and also adopted the zero-based budgeting all in a bid to ensure transparency and accountability. To ensure government institutions become service-oriented, new ministries and agencies were created. Ministry of Business, Innovation and Technology, Ministry of Housing and Urban Development, Ministry of Internal Security and Home Affairs, Kaduna Geographic Information Service, Kaduna Internal Revenue Service, Kaduna Public Procurement Authority, Kaduna State Traffic and Environmental Law Enforcement Agency, Drug and Substance Abuse Control Agency, Kaduna State Transport Regulation Authority, Kaduna Roads Agency, Kaduna Peace Commission, Kaduna Investment Promotion Agency, Kaduna Facility Management Agency, Kaduna Water Service Regulatory Commission, Kaduna State Power Supply Company, and Kaduna Contributory Health Insurance Authority. To improve the quality of education in the state, the administration embarked on massive renovation of the state-owned public schools as well as tertiary institutions across the state. Employed 25,000 teachers in public primary schools and over 2,500 science teachers in secondary schools to tackle the manpower challenge and introduced a free feeding program and free books in public primary schools, taking thousands of children off the streets and back to schools. Our focus has been to revive the integrity of public education. We've uh, invested strongly in uh, rebuilding our schools. All the teachers that we have recruited you know, have the minimum qualification of National Certificate of Education in conformity with the national policy. 
the administration embarked on massive urban renewal road projects across the state. Some of these projects include the Kawu to Lugard Hall roundabout expansion project, the realization of Rigasa Road, expansion of Kano Road Junction to PZ Road in Zaria, renovation of the Namdi Azikiwe Expressway, among others. There are also ongoing construction of drainages across the state. To improve the healthcare delivery system, the administration renovated and equipped healthcare centers across the state with skilled manpower and state of the art equipment. The government decided to embark on expansion and renovation of 255 PSAs. In fact, slightly more than 255. As you know, we have 255 political wards. You know, so this is what is ongoing. There's massive expansion and renovation of these 255 PSCs. Um, well staffed, well equipped with necessary commodities that will provide care to the people at the grassroots. Partnered with the UK Department for International Development to install over 1.3 megawatts of power solar systems in primary healthcare facilities and its effort to increase access to safe drinking water from the current level of 54% to 100%. The administration commissioned the Zaria Water Supply, an expansion project. The administration of Nasir Arifai made concerted efforts in fostering strategic business partnerships, notably the partnership between Kaduna Refinery Consortium and the China Machinery Engineering Corporation to build a new 50,000 barrels per day refinery. The partnership with Bionas, a Malaysian firm to establish a biofuel plant for aviation. Partnership with Olam Group, Sunseed Group, Bill and Melinda Gate Foundation, Tony Blair Foundation, as well as Dangote Group of Companies for the creation of job opportunities. To address the security challenges across the state, His Excellency Malam Nasir Erufai equipped security agencies with the needed gadgets and operational patrol vehicles. Kaduna State under His Excellency Malam Nasir Erufai has witnessed both economic and social infrastructural growth in a very short period. It is indeed evident that this administration is resolute in making Kaduna State great again. Thank you.